Hello! Now I present to you the dirtiest, I mean the most wonderful toilet in the universe. Look what a shocking pile of paper. Why? <laughs> I don't know, but I kind of like it. I wanna grab it, yes. Ooh, a lot of dust. Whoa, and the shower looks good. Oh, there is something green and yellow and mold. And, wow. Oh, the resident Olga hasn't used her shower for a while. Mm. Let's start with the best part. These papers. Oh my. <laughs> I'm so hyped up. <laughs> As you can see, this is the best work I know. Some people commented to me on Instagram that I have staged this toilet. <laughs> I mean, I did get a good laugh from all the messages. Wow, they were so dusty, but they didn't smell at all. Or I didn't smell anything, but I don't usually smell anything. Oh, there are some bugs. Yes, tiny, tiny bugs, tiny creatures. It's okay, <laughs> but you are gone soon. <laughs> so today I'm cleaning in Sweden and I have made uh, two other videos from this apartment. I recommend watching them if you want to see the rest of this apartment. The resident Olga has lived here for a few years after escaping from an abusive relationship. Her husband was a physical and mental abuser and his last act was shocking. He abused Olga again. But this time Olga was pregnant, for her husband of course, and she lost the child. It broke my heart when I heard the story. But that was the last time and Olga escaped, thank God. However, after that she has suffered from many other health problems. And for example, walking is difficult for her. That's why cleaning has been extremely hard for her. I noticed that Olga had bought a lot of cleaning supplies and tools. I mean, she has tried to clean, but now when her home is in this stage, it feels impossible to clean it. It's not really, it's not. Nothing is impossible to clean or fix. I mean, if you are struggling in life, everything can change. Life can get better. And that's why I'm here today. But yeah, that's why Olga asked for my help. She was so sick of her home and want a change in her life. See, she wants to live in a normal, clean and fresh home, like all of us. Hmm. I also told Olga's story to my sponsor Cine Cleaning. You have seen me using their dish brushes, their kitchen spray and everything many, many times. If you have watched my videos. <laughs> but yeah, they wanted to help Olga also. They said that they could cover all my travel expenses, hotels, flights, foods, everything, as long as I could help Olga. That is super duper sweet. By the way, I was here with my assistant and uh, this was his first time cleaning with me. And he was like, no way, you can't clean that floor. And I was like, Hey, watch me. This is this is easy for me. <laughs> Here I'm using Cine's flat mop and dish soap. I'm just spreading it first and then 
uh, I shut down my cameras and I let it sit there like 10 minutes and after that I scrub it again and now I'm just rinsing it oh my god so satisfying have you ever seen something so satisfying I haven't I haven't <laughs> wow this I I think this is the best bathroom floor I have ever cleaned yes but wait until you see how I'm cleaning the shower floor. Hey, by the way, I'm using here Cine Scrubber. It's great for the grout between the tiles. Ooh, look how brown! Oh my god, love it! It's so great. So great. Okay, I think there's still something, so I'm just quickly scrubbing it with this big brush and oh now it's clean do you remember those guys that i found when i was picking up the paper they are gone so sorry guys but you have to find a new home <laughs> Okay, let's use Cine's kitchen cleaner. By the way, this kitchen cleaner is great for your bathroom. Try it. You won't be disappointed. And this detail brush, mm, 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 mm. I just love it. But yeah, did you see what a pile of dust was on top of the shower? I mean, Olga hasn't showered here like in months. But now? Things are about to change. Oh, it's so shiny. <laughs> nice. Love it. This yellow stuff is dirty lime scale. So I'm using kitchen cleaner because I'm going to scrape that off. Kitchen cleaner won't work for lime scale, but here I just use it so it gets slippery, so I can scrape it off more easily, like this. If you are removing lime scale, the secret is to use hard tools, such as steel daddy and a scraper. And look, goodbye lime scale, looking nice. Noticed that there was still a few spots, so I'm using a steel daddy. Steel daddy scrubs off any kind of dirt, yes, but you should use it gently. Okay, let's see what we are facing here. Oh! This floor looks pretty good, but I want to see it without the foam. Okay, we have some kind of dirt there and also a lot of lime scale. So first I'm just removing all the dirt with dish soap and with this big cine cleaning brush. I like to use brush when I have a floor made of tiles and there is grout between the tiles because then the brushing cleanses the grout and the tiles at the same time. Okay, now we have left only the lime scale, so let's just scrape that off. Do you agree that the rinsing is so satisfying? Yes, goodbye lime scale! See you next time! <laughs> I know you are waiting for me! <laughs>
right, this thing doesn't look that bad, but I hope that under these papers and bottles we have a lot of stains. Yes, we do. Hmm, I was thinking that maybe we should use a kitchen cleaner, yes, because mm, I want to see what the kitchen cleaner can remove and after that if we have still some stains left I can use another product but I think it's working quite well mm. usually bathroom cleaners are acid-based uh, products so they remove lime scale and rust and uh, stains like that effectively but here we are facing like dirt and grease so that's why I always use first kitchen cleaner hmm there's something but let's brush it and scrub it away oh that was lime scale but I'm not using any product because these tools work with water just fine like that and now all the sink shines. I'm just wondering when was the last time it shined like this. <laughs> Amazing. This bathroom cabinet isn't that bad, but I still want to clean it because now I have time and I know Olga will appreciate that. Oh, well, now, now I can see that it has a beautiful layer of dust and dirt. Yes. Again, I'm using kitchen cleaner and the Sinis Detail brush. I love it because it has two different brushes in one brush. <laughs> and there is also tiny scraper involved so it's super handy against any kind of dirt oh I just love when this water is so dirty <laughs> it's so brown or maybe gray <laughs> yay now let's reorganize this cabinet there was also a lot of trash so I don't know what we have left. Toothpaste, toothbrush holder, and these two. And that's it. But this mirror has a lot of fingerprints on it and some grease and dust and everything. Oh my gosh, these circle motions are so nice looking. Yes, I love the foam. Oh. <laughs> Surprise! Wow, it's so bright. I'm so happy. I'm in heaven because this bathroom has been like heaven for me. It has been so dirty. <laughs> Luckily, we still have some dust left. And guys, Soon we're about to see amazing before and after pictures because this transformation is wow, I can't even describe it. Do you even remember what this bathroom looked like when we came here? <laughs> the paper mountain and the mountains of dust. Wow, this is super nice super nice the dust is really sticky so I have to remove it by hand otherwise I would use a duster but it's really sticky now let's wipe it I have sprayed a little kitchen cleaner spray on my cloth so it glides nicely. Woohoo! Okay, guys, this is one of my favorite things in this bathroom. Oh my god! <laughs> 
This is the trash can lid. And it's super cute and super dusty. Oh my god, I took so many pictures with it. Oh, it was like a fangirl moment for me because when I saw this lid, I was like, oh my god, that's my friend. My best friend. Oops, sorry about that, but look, it's so white, it's so happy. It's almost smiling. And of course, a pink trash bag. Mm, nice and tiddy. <laughs> My happy and clean friend. You are welcome. <laughs> tiny, tiny details. Yes, this light switch is pretty nasty looking. But now it's white and bright again. By the way, these Cine kitchen cleaner towels or cloths are super good. Super duper good. Oh, there was so much grease, so I had to take a steel daddy. Yes. Now it's gone. There's only dust, so a little bit of spritz and cleaner and ditto brush and woohoo! Let's rinse it. Yes, and we have still the toilet undone. Yes, so let's do, let's clean that next. Oh, good, good. Good out it that you noticed that. <laughs> Let's start from the bottom. Usually you don't start from the bottom, but in this case it doesn't really matter because I'm cleaning these separately. So yes, I'm just brushing all the dust away. And then let's move on to the top didn't really matter because I'm using a different tools here. Here I'm using a scrub daddy and I'm throwing that scrub daddy away after this cleaning. Oh, there was some really sticky stains, so I changed my tool to steel daddy. And I'm also going to throw that away also because usually I clean these bathrooms, I mean toilets, toilet seats uh, with like use it scrub that it like with those that would anyway be thrown away after the cleaning. I usually use two sponges for these cleanings, one in the kitchen and one in the bathroom. I always throw away the bathroom sponge if I use it to the wash the toilet. But I wash the kitchen sponge in the dishwasher at home. <laughs> okay, here I'm using just dish soap. <laughs> Regular dish soap. And Cine's toilet brush. And voila, it worked. Let's rinse it and then are you guys ready to see the final result? Because I am. It's amazing, amazing. Wait for it. Here's the final result. Isn't it amazing? Before this bathroom has depressed or got down. But now that she sees this, she can finally breathe. When Olga came home, she was really shocked. This change was incredibly big. She had also bought me a present and was one of the most grateful people I have met in these cleanings. <laughs> See you next time. Bye bye.